The Residential Creative Arts and Design Community, the Studio, offers awards for outstanding research and service. These awards recognize and honor exceptional artistic projects and endeavors that will take place in the upcoming academic year. The awards are sponsored through the Division of University Housing and the Arts Institute. The Studio Research Award, Devin McDonald. My name is Devin McDonald. Uh, <laughs> my major is currently undecided. My artistic mediums are photography, poetry, and I'm beginning to do uh, some like digital stuff, playing around with Photoshop and Premiere and Illustrator and stuff. 2012, I graduated high school and I didn't have like a lot of direction, and so I reached out to a nonprofit that I was aware of in Seattle and tried to offer like service any way that I could. And after working for them in Seattle for like six months, uh, I actually was sent by them to Guatemala to work from their Guatemala office. And I ended up staying there for seven months. And so that was like my first taste of moving abroad. I knew from there I was just gonna keep on going, but I didn't know where. So I kind of just went wherever like opportunity took me. I went to Colorado, New Mexico, Louisiana, New York. Um, and I also lived in California for a while. So I had a 35 millimeter camera the whole time and I was documenting it, but I didn't know why. I just knew I really liked the way the photos looked. And I compiled this stash of over a thousand photos that I didn't know what I was going to do with. So when I got here to University of Wisconsin, I started taking independent study with Faisal, who was my advisor. And then I had a creative writing workshop with Ahmad Johnson, and they're both very talented, talented artists. Ahmad kind of directed my writing, and Faisal helped direct and organize my photography. And um, we started to match them, and it has turned into a really cool series. So I'm really excited about this award in particular because I was already going home for the summer. I'm from a neighborhood in North Seattle that's not really talked about, and it's a really interesting mix of people. It's kind of a neglected part of town. My goal is to create a body of work that really represents the people of that small pocket very well. And as well documents the large array of lifestyles. It'll be more photography. Uh, I'm going to have an audio recorder. I'm going to document their stories and hopefully create it into like a mixed medium presentation. The studio is really cool. I really like living on the studio because every person on the studio floor is like actively engaged in some artistic medium and genuinely given that you know we're young people they're very passionate about it and it's really fun to be with people who are very excited. I think within the first wave community a lot of ideas are kind of like commonplace or known that haven't yet spread to the rest of the campus community and I think being there puts me in a position where I'm very intentional about the art that I create and knowing how it will be received in the first wave community, but then as well the larger community on campus. Definitely thank you for the support and the grant. Um, I think it's so cool to foster um, art, especially in young people, it's so necessary. And I'm very confident that the voices that I'll be representing and um, the the art that I'm, I'm gonna create will bring to the University of Wisconsin a perspective that's not present on this campus.